This is the costume chamber and it's time to do some magic. So Skelson is Europe's largest outdoor museum. Uh, it was founded in the 1800s to preserve and display Swedish history and culture and to some extent animals. There are moose and lynxes and stuff. And the first Christmas market here was in 1903 and that's what they still try to preserve now. So when I was selling here this summer, I could wear my own clothes. Uh, but now, with the Christmas market, everyone has to dress up. Um, so usually they have people in the buildings showing stuff and they're dressed up. And actually most of the buildings here are real buildings from other parts of Sweden that have been carted here, which is kind of cool. So you can go see the smithy, you can go see people, well I like when they spin yarn, obviously. Um, but you can see all of this old stuff. But Christmas market, all the vendors have to dress up. So right now I am really, really warm. You can probably see my glasses fogging up because it's all this wool and all these layers. But it's actually pretty cold. So later in the day, we are going to be freezing. Today is Sunday. We were here yesterday. It got pretty cold towards the end of the day. I was really happy to get in a warm sauna. We didn't sell that well yesterday. There were a lot of people, I think between 10 and 15,000 visitors. But I'm hoping today being a Sunday, even though it's not the first of Advent yet, it is sort of the fourth weekend before Christmas. So I'm hoping we'll sell better. So fingers crossed. This is before the throngs of people show up. Also, I find it hilarious that the band over at the the dance area is playing a fairy tale of New York because that does not feel very appropriate. It's 2.30 now, so we've been here for about four and a half hours and we have another hour and a half to go. And for the first couple hours it was really slow. I was feeling a little despondent. It's always hard with markets because you don't really know how you're going to do. Sometimes you do really, really well when you weren't expecting much. And sometimes you, you try not to hope too much, but sometimes you do have a lot of hope and you don't do that well. But we have sold a decent amount right now, but also I think I try not to think about exposure, because like a joke, you know, exposure is something people die from. Um, but I do think this is a good place to be seen because people who may not be buying Christmas presents quite yet might remember me. I've passed out a lot of cards for, for the store. So we'll see how it does. But I'm also, it's not quite as cold today, but I am getting ready to go home and take a hot bath. It's now about 4.30, the day is over. It picked up, so I'm in the black, which feels good. Black Sunday, woo! <laughs> um, and you can see we've packed everything up, everything is nice. I'm happy with the weekend. It's Like, like I said, it's always hard. And I joke that it, it feels really good when people like your stuff, but if you're having one of those days when nobody's buying stuff, you're like, liking my stuff doesn't pay my bills, but once people start buying, it is really nice to have people really, really like your stuff. And now I am curious because I was passing out a card with a coupon code. And so I'm curious to see if I'm gonna get any Etsy sales from this in the next couple of weeks. And I'm gonna go down and take off the rest of, of my fancy outfit and uh, head home. We got home and unpacked couple of the boxes because I needed to take a bunch of pictures to update the Etsy store. And now what I really want to do, I feel like I say this a lot in videos, is take a nap but I need to edit the pictures and get the Etsy store updated at least part of the way so that people can buy Christmas presents and I'm gonna try and kill two birds with one stone and dye my hair so that it can do its thing while I'm editing because I'm ridiculous. And we're going to London next weekend and I would like my hair to not be all sort of washed out and weird. Um, yeah, uh, 
I'm too tired to do the whole outro thing, so click things, um, write things, whatever, and um, have a good week.